think it's very much hope for the future of the secondary schools of Barbados. What was the major thing that we're covering? So they discussed about security and what they need to bring back the Parents Teachers Association back into the schools and everyone can have an active say in what's going on in the future of their students at the schools. Uh, when you first heard about the incident, what was going through your mind? When I first heard about the incident, I think it was just like a fight. I didn't really think it was nothing too serious because I was home and they told me that the school is on lockdown, so I just thought it was a fight. I didn't want to believe the worst. Um, and how much did you know about the issues that were affecting the school in terms of you know, gang violence? or? No, I didn't really know much about the issues. So now that you guys had a meeting, what are your suggestions? What do you want to see changed or what do you want to see implemented? Well, I never had an issue with the school with my daughter and I still feel the same way. It's, it's safe as far as I'm concerned. You know you have problems all over so I don't think it's the school as the problem. I think the society has the problem, not the school. Satisfied are you with what I say compared Well, I'm satisfied with everything the minister said, for sure. Um, well, I question I asked that I don't really understand is about the question is when this kid get murdered so many stabs why what happened no if nobody at all couldn't save try to save him that's the only thing that really bothered me because I didn't get a really good response from that um it was an informative program um obviously but as a collective we're trying to find the way forward Obviously, it's a hard thing. I mean, my condolences to the family, both families actually. Um, it is a hard thing, but everybody's there trying to find a way of moving forward. When you uh, first heard that this incident had took place, taken place, what was going through your mind? Remember, son, it's horrifying, son. Straight up. Okay. Um, One of the things that came up, even from the minister, was that it's obvious we are. Um, there's nothing put in place, actually your parent but then still you could pick up certain things along the way that's everybody saying there are things there's always things but then if a teacher spends so much time with the day so much time so much hours in one day with a the child then the teacher should be trained in that area to pick up some of these things and therefore relate them to the parent and then as a ministry should be something in place where a parent could go and get some help for a child